In this video we will show you how you can easily assemble an optical table after shipping. Step 1. We place the breadboard on the support frame. The board is marked with white rings on the underside, this is where the leg units are placed. This ensures that the best vibration properties are maintained. We recommend a forklift, or a crane to lift the plate. Slowly lower the plate so that it is ideally placed on the frame. Move the frame or the support feet, if possible, so that they are within the white circles. Step 2. Lower the leveling feet to secure the table to the ground and ensure the casters are in air. You will need a wrench. To align the table straight to the ground, use a level, you can simply place it on the table and check its position in the XY plane. To lower the feet, simply screw them clockwise with your hand until they touch the ground. Keep screwing until the feet are safely on the floor. Then use the wrench until the casters are no longer in direct contact with the ground. Repeat these procedures for all four feet and check with the level whether the plane is still okay. Step 3. Locking the leveling feet. Turn the lock nut counterclockwise all the way to the top. This ensures that your feet can no longer move, and you can compensate for unevenness in the floor. Step 4. Connect the optical table to the compressed air supply. You will find the connection hoses, and a small tool set in the scope of delivery. A small pair of pliers is ideal for cutting the tubes, with which you can simply clip off the tube. Connect the compressed air to the compressed air limiter. With the limiter you can precisely set the applied pressure. We recommend a pressure between 3 and 4 bars. In case the table cannot swing freely, increase the pressure steadily. Remember that you should not add more than a maximum of 6 bars to the system. Adjust the lever arm screws so that the lever arm is horizontal. Step 5. Precise adjustment of the leveling feet. Press down on the leveling valve to check that the table is supplied with compressed air. You should hear air flowing when you press the lever down, this ensures that the table is supplied with air. Use a more accurate spirit level to level the table. This can also be a digital variant. Adjust the table height screw so that the optical disc is horizontal in the XY plane. Be careful when adjusting, do not exceed the maximum length of 10 mm. Step 5. Tighten the lock nuts. After leveling the table, tighten the lock nuts. So, the screw position can no longer be changed. Tighten all other lock nuts, the table can be put into operation. Step 6. Final check whether the optical table has been properly adjusted. Gently push the table down to see if the table adjusts its level. Check if the table returns to its original position.